Hey friends, we are doing something fun today. We live in a small town that has just a few fast food restaurants. So today we're going to a big city and we are gonna go try some new fast food items, some new things that just came out in March and April. So we're super excited about that. Right now we're in the Dunkin' drive-thru. We are getting, I'm getting the churro signature latte and the empanada. I'm getting my original iced coffee with cream. When Sarah says big city, remember she came from a town with about 40 people. <laughs> to me, this is a moderate sized village. Well, right now we live in a town that only has about 12,000 people, so it's pretty small. It does have a few places, like we're in Duncan in our... Thanks. I'm gonna tell you a little secret though. I've already tried the churro donut, Zero out of 10 would not recommend. I was not gonna get it again, even for this video, because it's gross, it's hard, it tastes stale. There's nothing I like about it. And I love churros, so I was super excited about it. Don't get it. And that was not just a review from our own Duncan. She I've seen saw someone people. else say that as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It was a bad experience for her. To me, any experience at Duncan is a good experience. <laughs> William's favorite. Thank you. Yeah, good Thanks. And Sarah got dessert for coffee. We scored the churro <laughs> latte. Oh, here we go. Churro signature latte. Look, it's got lots of whipped cream, cinnamon, sugar on top. Mm, it's good. Is it? It's really good. It has that kind of burnt butter taste. Do I taste it? Um, it's really sweet, though. If I ordered that on my own, I would ask for less pumps of whatever the sweetness is. It's a little too sweet for me. I drink my coffee with just cream. That's pretty sweet. Yeah, that's good though. I would get it again. Okay, let's try this empanada. What are the ingredients in that, do you know? I have no sausage, bacon, egg, cheese. I'm not sure. Here's what it looks like. So it's savory. It looks like a fruit yeah, pie. Yeah, savory. <laughs> oh, it's really soft. I was expecting it to be crunchy. Want a bite? Sure. So far, I don't see the fillings. Here we go, eggs. To me, the outside is like a crescent roll, kind oh. of. I think it's a more like a fakery pastry dough. Mm. Mm. Now I got the filling, I really like it. You do? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's pretty good. It's the really sausage good. is good. I like it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Empanada. Empanada. Anything might be good for me right now, though, because I literally just woke up late, ran around, got everything, got dressed, got ready, got to take William to an appointment, and I'm like, a little frazzled. We're at KFC, and we wanted to get that chicken pizza thing, the chitza, but they don't have them here. So we ended up getting the Georgia Gold Saucy Nuggets, which is a new item, and this Mountain Dew I've never tried before, so... Something I, lightning. I, yeah, sweet lightning. Sweet I, lightning. We never drink Mountain Dew. So this should be fun. Oh, excellent. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. you. Have a good day. Thanks. Too. This is like a, the three <laughs> That dude was one of them. Okay. We're at the first lunch stop, would you say? Yeah. And it is KFC. It was a nightmare to order this. <laughs> it was a lot harder than it should have been. <laughs> so we got the Georgia Gold Saucy Nuggets. They have so many different flavors of Saucy Nuggets, but um, somebody's favorite is Georgia Gold. So Hers. <laughs> and a special Mountain Dew, it's called Lightning something. Sweet Lightning. Sweet Lightning. He said it's like a peach flavor. Peach flavor. These look basically really not that appetizing. Okay. But let's stir them together and see if they get better. Sarah eats with her eyes a lot. I'm more on the taste side, but I like to eat with my eyes as well. Got the good old spork good happening. Good old spork. Okay. Here we go. Now that looks good. I believe most people are doing the best they can with what they have. Mmm. 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 That's so good. It is? Mmm. -hmm. It may look bad, but it tastes good. Yeah, that's a hit. We that only ordered a so five good. piece. 
I wish we'd ordered 10. <laughs> we have a lot more stops to go, so we're just trying to get the smallest amount we can at each. Mm -hmm. Okay, sweet lightning. This Scorch. has a little heat in the back, though. Do you agree? Mm-hmm. That tastes like peach Mountain Dew. Hmm. Yeah, I like that. Okay, KFC, weird, friendly, but weird service. Um, Really not appetizing looking, but delicious. Yeah, and the peach is very peachy. It's it's pretty good, I like it. Mm-hmm, mm-mm-mm, so good. I'm gonna give KFC a thumbs up this morning. It's... We have no chicken places in the town we live in. No, they closed. So it's kind of nice to get some chicken. Yeah. We picked up a peacock while we were at Hobby Lobby. <laughs> He's joining us today. Okay, sorry about that. that. That's okay. Could I have a cantina burrito? Okay. And um, a small dragon fruit freeze? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I have like a little Thank you. Thank you. I'm pretty sympathetic to food servers. I, I think I'm, I has too many jobs. Right I now. have worked in the fast food industry before, and you generally have not enough labor, and it's fast paced. People oftentimes don't know how to order. It's just very difficult. I have a lot of compassion. He was he had to do the drive through, ordering and taking my money and giving me my food, and his computer wasn't working. Oh wow. Okay, it was kind of a fiasco, but we're good. Feel bad for that guy today. We have the new Taco Bell chicken cantina menu. It's like a different kind of chicken they have. And um, this is the burrito and I have heard good things about it, so. And she got the dragon fruit slush? That was freeze, dragon, dragon fruit, fruit freeze. freeze. Here's what it looks like. It is, doesn't look like it's holding together very well. I heard it's super saucy and um, you wanna take a first bite? chicken there's cabbage lettuce real saucy I heard mm, smoky smoky's what I got out of it too actually it smoky sorry my camera's falling down oh. really smoky in a good way crunchy cabbage this is delicious mmm Delicious. I don't even know how to describe that. Fizzy, like fizzy and sweet, like and sweet. Yeah, but it's really good. Really good. Yeah. Yeah, mm. I don't know how to describe this, but it is good and it is really. Sorry about the lighting. It's really pretty. I love that burrito. It's really smoky. Mhm. Mm no, I have to tell you something. I checked our YouTube today, you guys. I haven't told William this yet, but somebody left us a comment that they love us and we're like their, um, we're like their YouTube mom and dad. Oh. And it's comforting to watch us. <laughs> I love that. If you left that comment, she you made you my now. whole day. That made my whole day. That's what I want. Wholesome <laughs> content. If, you, if we're your YouTube mom and dad, Welcome to the family. I love it. Our next stop was Little Caesars for their new Crazy Puffs pepperoni flavor. They look like pepperoni cupcakes, sort of. They do. Okay. Exactly what they look like. I need to eat over that. Yeah, one. sure. That looks good. Ready? Three ninety nine for four of them. That's a That's deal. That's a deal. Yeah. It tastes just like a saucy pizza to me. Mm -hmm. Like a thick crust pizza. Mm-hmm. Like a little pepperoni slice in there. It's a really good price too. <laughs> Same time. Yeah, I like them. Mm -hmm. They're definitely worth three ninety nine. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're at Arby's. We just ordered the brown sugar bacon BLT and a Coke Zero, and it's over ten dollars. Exactly ten dollars. Exactly ten dollars. 
I actually have high hopes for this one though. Who doesn't like bacon and brown sugar? Yeah. I don't know if any of you remember when they had the pork belly sandwich at Arby's. That is killer. I got a quarter of one once. <laughs> William's legally blind, so I drive. Oh, I mean, he doesn't have a driver's license anymore. So we were going to share one like we've been doing all day today. And it, it was, since I was driving and we were on vacation, he said, just eat half of it and hand me the rest and I'll finish it. That way we didn't have to pass it back and forth while we were driving. And supposedly, by the time I handed it back to him, he says there's only a quarter of it left, but whatever, it was good. No, thank you very much. Thank you. Best and easiest customer service of the day. She was really friendly. I'm gonna turn this around just so you guys can see. Our local friends will know exactly where we are when you see this big cow. Okay, here we go. You have the meats. Dun, da, da, da. Wait, bacon, brown, brown sugar. sugar, bacon, BLT. BLT. It's a mm. fairly substantial sandwich. I was thinking it was going to be tiny. Ooh, look at this. You can see that bacon does have brown sugar on it. Wow, okay. Okay, this is not what I was expecting. There's a big mayonnaise spot. You're not going to want that. Okay. Here you go. Caught it. <laughs> it was pretty tasty for what it is, I would say. I would just like toast for a BLT. I don't need the Hawaiian bread. I, th I think it detracts from it a little bit. But it's, it's good. It tastes like a BLT. It's so sweet. Mm -hmm. I love big. the brown sugar bacon. I would like to just eat that separately. <clears throat> I'm going to try this piece that fell off. I like Arby's though because they aren't your typical fast food, you know. They have, they'll they try different things. I like that. That bacon it on its own is where it's at. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Oh, Thank you. Thank you. Have a great day. Here's what we got at Wendy's. This Cinnabon pull apart. A blueberry lemonade. And then the orange frosty. Here you go, honey. You want to hold that? Okay. What do you want to try first, the cinnamon? Sure. Great dessert for the day. A little frosting on them. Mm. Mm -hmm. It's hard to go wrong with Cinnabon in my opinion, so I have high hopes for this. It's really good, but it feels like a breakfast item. I don't know if blueberry lemonade is new to Wendy's because we don't have a Wendy's, but it sounded good. These taste really good. And they have that nice cream cheesy icing. Mm -hmm. But texture wise and the way they clump together, they remind me of a bread pudding. I thought bread pudding too. You're not gonna like this, honey, it's sour. I'm not a big lemonade person, but I will try it for the sake of just trying one. This little frosty. I'm nervous because I don't like dreamsicle flavor at all. That is all yours. <laughs> That's what it tastes like. Dreamsicle? It tastes exactly like if you've ever had baby aspirin. That's it. Baby aspirin. I'm going to go with lime sherbet. A little bit of sherbet or whatever it's you called. You mean orange? That's the one I'm going to go with. <laughs> But yeah, it's okay to me. It's not uh, not set up very well. It's very, very um, viscous. Viscous! It's runny. For those of you who talk English. Or speak English. 
I had too much baby aspirin as a kid and I just cannot stand the smell or the taste of that uh, dreamsicle in anything. But cinnamon pull aparts, really good. You know, this might not be as sour if you weren't eating something sweet. Oh, so yeah. Maybe this isn't as I sour. I think it had a tart, uh, strong lemon taste. It's but. lemonade. <laughs> this is this is definitely good. I like these pull parts. Yum. Well, while we're enjoying dessert, we want to thank you for joining us on this journey today. I had a lot of fun. Al Me too. Although I will say, I'm a little sad at the shape of service in today's economy. Yeah. It's um, it's sad. I think people are overworked. They don't carry enough labor because labor costs are higher. Everyone was nice enough. It just seemed you could like just see the step stress. down of you stress. You could see and yeah. feel the stress. And um, not just in fast food, but we also had our oil changed while we were in town. And even there, it just seemed like everyone's job felt hard and stressed. And um, yeah. So next time you're out at a fast food place, maybe give a smile and a kind yeah. word to the <laughs> people and make them feel better. It's... Uh, it's hard to serve other people at times and I, I honor that kind of work. So we do thank everyone that served us today and we thank you for watching. I hope that you enjoyed the video. We think this was super fun. It's not often that we eat fast food and it's we never really get some of these things because we don't have them in our town. But you see how much I cook on our channel. So <laughs> now we mostly almost always eat at home. So um, having whatever this was today five or more fast food places is unusual but it was fun it was fun and i got a date out with my and, best and we girl. had so many errands to run in between that this is stretched over like six hours or something so it, it didn't seem like a, a an overindulgence i mean it's expensive if yeah. you add it all up because yeah. oh do you have a favorite for the day the the chicken uh cantina chicken burrito at taco bell mm -hmm. yeah it was good that um, chicken from KFC, once I stirred it around, that was probably that Georgia Gold chick, saucy chicken nuggets, probably my favorite. Those were so good. But I didn't, there was nothing I didn't like, except that baby aspirin shake. <laughs> Please for watching, like and subscribe and comment if you would and have a great day. Let us know if you tried any <laughs> of these things and what were your favorite. Thanks for watching, everybody. Right. Bye. I've been in this bigger city for just like two hours and I'm so glad I live in a small town. I don't know how you guys feel, but I haven't seen a cow or a cornfield for two hours and I think it's breaking my heart. I'm not, I'm not used to this 